Hello everybody, it's your boy Chillwill, and today I review one of my favorite comedies of the late 2000s, and that is Tropic Thunder, starring Ben Stiller, Robert Downey Jr., and Jack Black, and they get stuck in Vietnam after their movie set goes awry, and I just love the cast here. This has one of the greatest casts ever. It has Robert Downey Jr., Jack Black, Ben Stiller, but those are the main ones, Steve Coogan, Jay Baruchel, Danny McBride, Brandon T. Jackson, Bill Hader, and Nick Nolte, as well as Tom Cruise and Matthew McConaughey, which I just like, just wow, I love this cast. So, there's that. I think this movie really benefits from everyone just working together and just having the best chemistry in the movie. Everyone's just having a ball making this movie, which I love. And they also, uh, I actually have the director's cut this time, so I might have to review the theatrical version, maybe. Maybe not. I think this version is good enough. So, now, the I like how it like pops open and pops back again. Who left the fridge open? I love these, uh, I love this, uh, these trailers too, so, yeah. Nick Nolte's also really good in the movie, I have to say he's, uh, He's like in, he's like in Vietnam War veteran, and he's really funny in the movie. I also like how it's very meta here. It's like a very meta Vietnam War movie, where it's like the set goes awry, so these actors have to pretend like they're soldiers in Vietnam. So yeah. I think everyone delivers a really good performance in this movie. Everyone's, like, really funny in the movie. Robert Downey Jr. unironically actually got nominated for an Oscar for his performance as Kirk Lazarus. And you know what? He actually does kind of deserve it. Ben Stiller's really good in the movie. I love how it's just Ben Stiller's just running the show. Ben Stiller wrote it with Ethan Cohen and Justin Thoreau, who also wrote, uh... Ethan Cohen wrote, uh... Holmes and Watson. Seriously, I had to like brain fart because that movie was so awful. But overall, I'd have to give this movie a solid 9.7 out of 10. Arguably one of the funniest movies ever. And watch good movies, my homies.